For those of you who missed this week's episode of the Shadow Spark Chronicles, here's how it's going. As the group collects the hawkweed, Bishop hears some sounds coming from a nearby rock pile. As he investigates the sound, he realizes that it is actually a nest of baby rock birds, and off in the distance, they turn and see the mother flying in quickly. Bishop yells for everyone to head back into the caverns for safety, but the Rhyme Warden appears from the skies to save them. The ship takes some damage from the rock as it makes its escape. Gwynton tells Colton that Governor's Den is the group's next destination, his home, and the ship should be able to get repaired there. On their journeys, Oz and Grizz have a heart-to-heart in the early hours of the morning, and as Bishop arrives on the deck, Grizz walks off, not wasting the opportunity to belittle Bishop yet again. Oz apologizes, and the two begin another argument about servitude, giving up, and having faith. As the rest of the group make their way up to the deck, Justinian decides to ask Colton to set him up with a sparring match with a Frost Reaver to see how the training works. Colton happily obliges the request, and after a short period, Colton returns with Grizz, and the match begins. The match is short-lived, though, as Grizz is the more experienced fighter, and Justinian falls in defeat. The rest of the day goes by uneventful, and the group bunks down for the night. They are then awakened in the night by the ship jerking, and they all head up to the deck. The ship begins careening towards the ocean, and the party tumbles over the sides into the dark, rough waters of the ocean below. Please join us every Monday at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time as we continue with the ongoing adventures of the Shadow Spark Chronicles. And as always, we will see you in the dungeon.